Hello, my friends, and welcome back to Math Time. And today we're going to learn how to add. First, before we get started, we always do our 10 frame counting. Are you ready? Let's go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Nine, ten. Ten counters on our ten frame. Today we're learning about addition. Do you know what addition means? Addition simply means to add more. So if you have, say, two dots over here, and then you put one more, you're adding more. So addition means to add more. So you will see later how we're going to do it. But you know we always start with a story. So we're going to read a little poem about adding, and then we're going to try to see if we can use our 10 frame to help us to add, and then we're going to add dots and write equations. So my friends, let's get ready for this fun time in math. So before we begin with our poem, I'm going to show you what you're going to need for today to practice addition with your families. You're going to need this sheet right here. This is all you're going to need is this sheet right here and something to write with preferably a pencil. Okay, so let's begin our poem. Okay, so here's our poem about fruit salad. And it's also gonna help us to add things together. And then we're gonna use this to learn how to add on our tin frame. And then we're gonna do some adding. So let's get started. Fruit salad, five red apples on the tree. One for you and four for me. Five yellow bananas on the tree, two for you, and three for me. Five purple plums on the tree, three for you, and two for me. Five green pears on the tree, four for you, and one for me. Five orange apricots on the tree, five for you, and zero for me. Okay, we're gonna use this poem to help us to add on our 10 frame. Let's go. So now we have our poem with our numbers we're gonna use, and we have our 10 frame. We're gonna play a game. Who wants to play a game? Who wants to play a game? <laughs> we all wanna play a game because playing games are fun. I'm gonna pretend to be the red team, and you're gonna pretend to be the green team. I'm gonna use the red dots, you're going to use the green dots. And we're going to use these counters to help us to do some addition, all right? Because we're learning how to add. So let's go to our poem again. And it says, five red apples on the tree, one for you and four for me. So how many apples do we have on the tree? If there is one for you and four for me, Let's see if we can show that on our 10 frame. So you're going to be green. So one for you. And then one, two, three, four for me. So my friends, what is one plus four? That is addition. That means you add them together. So let's see how many we have all together. One, two, three, four, five. This is one way to show one plus four equals five. Let's do another one. Five yellow bananas on the tree, two for you and three for me. So two and three, okay? Two for you, three for me. Let's show that on our 10 frame. So two for you, one, two, and one, two, three for me. So how many yellow bananas do we have on our tree? Two plus three equals how many? One, two, three, four, five. Two plus three equals five. Good job, my friends. 
Let's do another one. Five purple plums on the tree. Three for you and two for me. So this time it's going to be three for you and two for me. So three for you. One, two, three, and then two for me. One, two. So one, two, three plus one, two equals how many? Three plus two equals what? Let's count them. One, two, three, four, five. Three plus two equals five. Let's do another one. Five green pears on the tree. Four for you and one for me. Okay, four for you and one for me. So let's show four for you. One, two, three, four for you and one for me. One. So what is four plus one? Let's count them. One, two, three, four, five. Four plus one equals five. All right, I hope you're getting it. I hope you're getting it. Let's do one more, the last one we have. Five orange apricots on the tree. Five for you and zero for me. So, five for you and zero for me. So let's do five for you. Ready? One, two, three, four, five. Five for you and zero for me. Hmm. Is that zero? It's not? Right, that was one. Zero, so what does zero mean? Zero means none. Zero, zilch, nothing, right? So five plus zero equals how many? Let's count. One, two, three, four, five. Five plus zero equals five. My friends, you did a fabulous job doing addition. So now we're going to practice on our sheet. I'm going to show you the first one, and then you're going to go off with your families to complete the worksheet. So I want to start by doing the first one with you, okay? It says 5 plus 0 equals 5. So there's 5, and then there's 0 up here. And how many do you have? Right, 5. So when you're doing the sheet, you're going to look at the red dots and put that many, and then you're going to look at the blue dots and put that many. And then you're going to add all the dots together. That is simply how you do addition. All right, my friends? So go with your families and practice some addition. And I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.